Hi, I'm Jay Lutsky, an attorney, reaching out to you by video to explain the process in family court during the COVID-19 crisis. Currently, we have a case. Of course, the name's going to be confidential. I'm not going to mention who or what. But basically, it's a case where one parent does not want to return the child to the other one during a court-ordered visitation. What's happening right now is the lawyers are preparing papers which are being submitted to the court to discuss the matter of why the child's not being returned, what the, how COVID-19 impacts visitation, and or whether a child's health conditions impact visitation. All that will be done electronically. It will be filed with the court. How I'm communicating with my client remotely is we're emailing my client all the information from the other side, asking my client to give me his comments. The lawyers in the office are preparing opposition papers supporting my client's position. From there, we'll send a draft to the client to review, again, by electronically. We'll send it by email. If it's good and the proper corrections are made and the client's ready to sign, it could be signed by what's called e-notarize. Governor Cuomo allows notaries to notarize papers remotely. We watch people sign the papers on video and then we're allowed to notarize those documents and then utilize them in court. Once that's done, it will be submitted to the court electronically and we will await the judge's decision as far as what will happen with the visitation order on a, on a current case where one parent is not complying and not agreeing to allow the other party to see the child. We'll keep you up to date when I get a decision from the judge. If you have any questions, please feel free to call my office at 718-329-9500, 718-329-9500. For this matter, any type of matter, between the hours of Monday through Friday, from 9 in the morning to 4, we're all answering phones remotely, and I'm happy to chat with anyone. Thank you very much.